everyone! We are going to be recreating Morning Musume as best as we can and trying to get as many of the members and singles in before I go completely bankrupt. If I go bankrupt and I'm unable to get myself out, that means I've failed the game. So I'm going to attempt to do this. We're going to be starting brand new. I've already done two runs of this before. And both times I did terribly. So we are going to get into this right now. It is currently $20 on Steam if you're interested in getting this game. We're going to be picking the female option, last name, Sunku, and first name, Mariko. If you know, you know. Morning, Musume. So we're here to meet Fujimoto. He's the person who's going to give us the money so we can rent out this building. So we're going to be doing this very slowly. I have to build my office, and I'm going to put myself in here. We're going to build this dance studio first. And then we're going to get a dressing room so we get a stylist. We're also going to get a recording studio so we can get someone in here making music. And then we'll also get a little break space in... Well, uh, let's do one more. Mm, let's do a break room. And then we'll do one more of the dressing rooms because we're going to need to get our idols styled immediately. So I need to go and hire some staff. I'm going to be holding an audition to try to get some talent in here. So I'm looking for five girls. I think it's really gross. And I think, especially when you're looking at girls who are like 14, 15, 16 years old, and you're like, you're not allowed to date anybody. It's like, but why? They're like a kid. If you're an adult and you're bothered by that, it's the same idea as like when teachers are like, oh, that girl in my class can't wear spaghetti straps. She's distracting me. She's a child. Why are you looking at her? She's a kid. You're an adult. Like, don't you have any type of self-control? So, like, that's the thing that I feel like with the dating bands is it's like, you're an adult. You, you are never going to date this girl. Even a girl who's over 18, she's a celebrity. She doesn't owe you anything. So, I think it's gross. We're going to get five cards. Each one of these cards will show us a generic photo. And it'll also give us some stats. There will usually be at least one member who's going to be pretty high quality from the initial auditions. It'll just depend on which one it is. Ooh, okay, so she's my ace. She's immune to bullying and online harassment. Ah, so she's the older one. She's loyal. Events that would damage re relationships hurt less. So in order to kind of keep as authentic as possible, this is gonna be my Nyakazawa Yuko. I'm gonna need someone to be my Ishiguro Aya. This girl is the next oldest. She's 18, so I'm gonna choose her. I think this should be my Kaori. Her cool factor is pretty high, so I'm gonna choose her. And then I'm gonna choose this girl as my Abe. And I think this girl was 12. So she's gonna be my Fukuda. Like, honestly, they're all pretty good. I love her outfit, by the way. I want to make sure that they're all in the same colors, at least for the generations. This is generation one. I'm gonna have them severely underpaid. <laughs> like, this is only in the interest of saving money right now. Later on, when I'm doing more work, they'll get more money. And these are gonna be our bread and butter. He wanted to see how we're doing. It's been a week already, but we're fine. <laughs> we're a natural at this. Might be interested. Tapped into a professional network and managed to get a small mention on a local news broadcast. So there is a whole little story mode that's back here. We're gonna look at our tasks. So we have to upgrade promotion and performance to level one, which we've already done. <laughs> Mind if I step in for a moment? Sure, what's going on? You've been hard at work running the agency. I've been hard at work shaking hands with the right people. And if you shake enough hands, you start to learn about opportunities. So our task is we have to get promotion and performance up to level two. We have to have a thousand fans. And in order to get promotion up, we have to appear in a magazine, in three magazines, and launch an internet show. So we have to be following all these different parameters in order to get these things leveled up. That's the only way we can pro progress the story. So we have 50 fans. Oh no, we're already bankrupt. How are, we, how are we already bankrupt? Okay, well, we gotta take some money out. Looks like we gotta start doing some actual work now. So this is a problem. <laughs> we have no money. I'm going to start drafting up some singles. I know Tane. It also shows us stats here. We're not really gonna get a lot of males, which is fine. I'm not here to impress boys. We're gonna get a lot of girls who are gonna be interested. We can look at the sales chart too. Currently, there's nothing on here. Nobody's been releasing music. It's 2021. Not a single person has released music ever. This is the first time anyone's ever released music in Japan. The trends, there's also none right now. So we can keep an eye on these trends and that'll help us. So we can now choose the order of the girls. Doing it for the girls and the gays. Hell yes. Our ace, which is Abe, we're gonna keep her in the front and center so everyone can see her. We're gonna put Ida here. We're gonna put Asuka here. We're gonna put Yuko here. So the song is gonna be really cute. 
The chemistry is through the roof. We have 100% chemistry, which is great. I'm gonna work on the styling really fast. So let's get Yuko in here. I'm gonna change her hair. So the default original outfits will be red. Ooh, wait, that's cute. That's a cute hairstyle. She's got a slightly different cut, but I do like this as the first gen. So Ida cannot have this hair. <gasps> That hair's so fun. What is this? This outfit is so cool. I want to put her in that so bad, but I want them all distinguished by Jen. And then Abe's got to have a short hair. <gasps> this is cute. I, I like this hair. I don't think anything's wrong with this. I think I'm going to keep it. Although this would be the perfect hair for Yuko. JK Kimura. This is the one. And I'll go ahead and set up the second one. It's going to be morning coffee. We're going to put Abe at the front. <laughs> Cause we're, she's gonna be our ace. She's gonna be the, the leader of this group. And basically Yuko and Aya are gonna be in the background all the time. I'm gonna make creative choices I feel needed for this group, but this is where I'm gonna go right now. So right now, popular, the very top of the charts is rock and pop and a lot of rebellious lyrics. So we're gonna have to keep an eye out for the next singles. So this is really going to affect how the first single is gonna drop. Also, Yuko is not funny at all. She, her best quality is currently dancing, which is great. I love that for her. I'm gonna try to earn some money though. So now we're gonna do some performances, try to get some cash. Okay, we got our first photo shoot. So we can use Yuko to go do a cool photo shoot. We also can negotiate. We can do this twice to try to get more money, but sometimes it can backfire and we can get less money from the offer. Although I am running out of money. That is a problem. <laughs> I need to keep earning money somehow. Hopefully she starts getting me more proposals so I can get more photo shoots, so I can get more cash. Cause right now we're kind of kind of scraping for it right now. Oh, she failed again. What do I hire you for, ma'am? Why are you even here if you can't even get me a deal? I'll fire you and I won't be afraid. Oh wait, I need to nickname her. I don't want to nickname anybody else, but I'm gonna nickname her Roman. If you know, you know. We're gonna be poor for a little bit while I finish marketing. Yeah, I went to go fire one of my staff the other day and it was gonna cost me, for, on my other profile, it was gonna cost me like a million yen to fire her. And I'm like, what do I gotta pay out her life insurance or something for leaving? But I mean, she was very good at her job. So maybe it was like separation, which I have never been paid to be fired from a company, right? I'm not killing her. <laughs> Apparently I was ending her life or something. She's not gonna ever have a job again. Now I need to take out a loan. We're gonna go ahead and take from the bank. We're gonna take 5 million yen. Let's go ahead and release Ainotane. All right, so we sold 49 copies. That's it. So I'm gonna send out another audition. We're gonna do a local one. I'm looking for three girls. Shameless, she's unafraid of a scandal. I don't know if that's the type of girl that we want. Someone who doesn't get involved in relationships. Ooh, an ace. She's maternal. She gets along better with younger girls. A 21 year old who's a late bloomer, but she is completely unsexy. She is 21 years old and she is one in her sexiness. And then we've got a 23 year old who's trendy. She doesn't really have great stats, but she's got a lot of opportunity. I'm gonna pick her. I'm gonna choose the ace. This girl right here, because I think this scandal might be interesting later on. This is a cute hairstyle. I love this braid. <gasps> Look how fun this hair color is. I like this hair. I think this hair is actually kind of perfect. Summer Night Town, rock, about rebelling, because that's, well, maybe I'll wait. I don't know, I could be late to the game. And then we'll do cute, we'll do sexy choreography. It's not gonna get the hardcore fans, but we're gonna get a lot of teen and male and young adults in here, so. This could potentially get us more. Although I don't know, should I do pop? Let's try this. We're gonna change up the lineup a bit. This is probably gonna piss off Abe. Yeah, she was mad about that, I figured. And we're gonna put our new girls in the back. Banish them to the back. Although Mari can be in the center of anyone's. Do you wanna talk about anything particular? You're just here to chat. She talks about her favorite TV show. She has a pet spider. Oops, she's gotta go. We can't keep her. Not a pet spider. Getting, oh, I can cue more the more I go. I'm gonna go to her house and I'm gonna kill that spider. She has a poster of Leif Erikson in her bedroom. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Happy Leif Erikson day. Okay, we're gonna do Daite Hold On Me. Hopefully we're not behind the, the trends again. All right, we're gonna put Ida back here. She's furious. We're gonna put Sayaka here. We're gonna put K right there. We're gonna put Yuko in the back. That's where she always is and Aya in the back. Okay, we got... 365 sales. 
we're gonna chart the top five by force. I'm gonna release so many singles, they are not allowed to listen to anything else but Morning Musume. <laughs> so, I should probably work on rock. Rise up as crusaders of revolution. This line from Morning Musume's newest single seems to have ignited a controversy. Fans love the song's explosive rhythm and strong message, but we're catching fire for spreading a message that encourages rebellious behavior among young workers and students. At least according to one politician who blames the song for the abrupt spike in delinquency rates for the entire week since the song was released. According to him, our idols are somehow using subliminal messages to cause the changes in behavior. Defend Morning Musume's right to express themselves through their music. A vague statement defending Morning Musume's creative freedom serves to address the politician's radical accusations without stirring the pot further. Few people are so upset, but the statement gets just as much positive recognition from younger fans. We lost 218 fans, but we gained 74 young adults and 142 teens, so I'm like, that's fine, the teens will turn into adults. And we got two scandal points! That doesn't seem good. Go guys, show them who's boss. Morning Musume inspired me to live my life my own way, right? There we go. Hey, I noticed you made headlines yesterday. Not exactly the most positive headlines, but what can you do? So if you decide to live dangerously, just remain aware of the fact that it will carry real financial consequences. I don't care. I'm not worried. <laughs> While sales have been going well, Memory Station no Hikari has recently been accused of promoting a religious cult that has been gaining prominence lately due to a lyric that multiple people will claim have misheard. If that weren't enough, the claim has since spread to reach the ears of the group in question. Who has since begun to play Morning Musume's music during rallies and promotional events? Yikes! Unless you want to continue affiliated with this sect, it's been suggested at the staff that you deal with this quickly before things get further out of hand. What's our next move? Maybe a public release denying affiliation and condemning the cult. You have a press release crafted denying your affiliation and sect. The media immediately jumps on it, sensing controversy. Luckily, the story focuses on the fact that Morning Musume has publicly condemned the group. The cult makes for an oblivious or an obvious villain in the eyes of the public. And every good story needs a hero as a villain role. A role which Morning Musume seems to have slot into nicely. Could idol groups be a force for good in the world? Some parents seem to think so. Okay, first off, we need to change our policies. Cause I do not want to be associated with religious cults. I am so sorry, that is not what I am here for. EDM, why is EDM trending right now? That was the only one that I didn't get wonderful about friends and sexy choreo honestly that works out really well with love machine let's see we're looking for goto maki right now so we need an ace underdog bonus to all stats of your latest single didn't top the chart i mean she's a freaking gold ace i needed a goto it's great to be a part of morning musume it's us versus the world right well the world better look out because here we come this is kind of cute for generation outfit love machine we want digital release EDM about love and sexy. That's gonna top the charts. If it doesn't, I don't know what will. Okay, we're gonna put Goto at the front. She's brand new. She's gonna get all the attention. We're gonna put Mari up here. We're gonna put Abe right here. And then everybody else just goes in the back. They're all filler girls. We've been doing a lot of performances and my voice is a little worn out. In fact, we've had a performance every day for the past week. Yeah, because y'all need to make money. I know I just joined Morning Musume recently, so I don't want to complain too much because I'm glad to have the opportunity to be part of a group, but this is a little more than I was prepared for. Are things always like this? No, things aren't normally like this because we're not poor as fuck. <laughs> okay, it's a bit of a relief to know that. I don't want to sound like a complainer or anything. I know this profession has a bit of ebb and flow to it. Some weeks are really busy, other weeks have less going on. I guess I wasn't prepared to be so busy right off the bat, so shortly after I joined, but I will admit it's been a good learning experience. But in the meantime, you think we'll have any gaps in the upcoming performance schedule? Me sweating, looking at the six days I already set up for them to perform. I don't want to be singled out for special treatment, and I should be able to perform since I'm making an effort to rest my vocal cords by not talking too loud anytime we're on stage, but it'd be nice to have a break. You want a break? And you just started like two months ago! Don't get your hopes up! <sighs> oh, alrighty, I'll do my best to soldier on. Torment! You better suck it up, girl. <laughs> We need to make cash. We are almost a million yen in debt. <laughs> look at this. Look at this schedule. I, I need them to keep performing. I have nothing. In this universe, I'm going to end up on Twitter and they're going to be like, worst boss ever. Tormenting these poor young girls. You are the one spending all the money. I have staff. I have to pay them. 
Also, I think Godo's making more too much money. Oh yeah, no, she's complaining. She's making more money than all the rest of them. Okay, 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 drama time. We need Abe in here. Oh, I don't know if I want to go on a show called Big Nut. <laughs> not Big Nut. I'm not sure what you're reasoning behind the daily performances. Maybe you are thinking we really need the money, but the harder you push everyone, the more fatigued they feel. And when people are feeling tired, that's when injuries are most likely to happen. Huh. I know that's not usually the kind of thing I deal with directly since it seems like more injuries are caused by dancing than singing, but vocal cord injuries are a real thing. Just... <gasps> oh, I lost influence with her. I'm at negative two. I don't mean to tell you how to run Morning Musume. I just hope you realize that your actions have consequences. I did not realize that was something that can happen. So it looks like I'm gonna send them to the spa a little bit sooner. <gasps> She's injured? What? I did not know that was a thing. She can go on a hiatus for 90 days. Send this to a doctor to reduce hiatus time. I can't afford a doctor's visit. She's gonna have to go on a hiatus. Bye girl. One, they can have a day off. You want a good manager? Get over it. <laughs> I am a very good manager. Seven days till bankruptcy? Not good. So with Morning Musume's balance so far on the red, I figured it was time to have an honest conversation about how you plan to take Morning Musume out of the situation. Well, how about you stop holding my neck hostage and you let me have your money? Now, oh, she failed a business proposal again? If I fire her, I'm gonna have to choose somebody else. I, I mentally want to fire her though. I'm not gonna lie to any of you. She's failed me so many times. I'm like so tired of her. Hello, I'm calling from Hello Project to try and get a drama for Abe Natsumi. And they're like, nah. Nah. Y'all can see a concert now. So let's set one up. I'm gonna call it, because we just did Love Machine, we'll call it Live Machine. So now I can send out a regional audition. A golden ace! Unafraid of scandals. All right, she is my Rika. A 13 year old, a silver ace, but she's a snitch. This is gonna be Yossi, cause she's got, she's bonus when hosting a show alone. I don't know, what, what about this one? You know what, I like her. And then we're gonna choose the snitch. We're gonna do it. All right, I need one more girl. All right, I need one more good one to be my Kago. Honestly, that works really well for Suji's character. Okay, let's see, who did we get? We need one more. We need someone around the age of 13. Aha, 12 is fine. She's photogenic. That could actually be really helpful. That's cute. That's extremely cute. I wish that there were more of these hairstyles I could put on more of the members. I am gonna splinter off another group and we're gonna call it, so this will be like a splinter group and we're gonna have this be like some of the girls that don't quite fit in anymore that I would love to have other opportunities. But I'm gonna put Asuka in there cause she doesn't really fit in the fantasy anymore. Of, oh. JK Kimura. You ever hear a conversation in the dance room? Oh god, eyes already causing a ruckus. Kago Ai, you ready for the big show tomorrow? Mm. I'm not sure if I'm ready. Eh? Whoa, don't say that. You've done the practice, you put in the work, you're ready for this. Eto. I'd like to think that, but practicing dance in front of a mirror is totally different from doing them on stage. I mean, you don't get nervous right before a big show. What if we disappoint the crowd? Mm. You've got to realize something, Kago Ai. The crowd isn't there to judge you. They're on your side. When it comes to concerts like this, people wouldn't show up if they weren't fans. Everyone out there in the crowd is rooting for you to succeed. If you're not nervous before a show, like, are you even doing it right, you know? All right, I'm gonna put her in Midnight Musume. And I think I'm gonna put Aya in there as well. I wish. I have a feeling that Pop's gonna start making a return because it hasn't been on the charts for a while. So we'll do Pop and we'll make that about friends with a very cute style. I have a feeling this is gonna end up making it in here. We're gonna put Kago in the front. She's gonna be our new front girl, I think. She's working her way up there. We'll put Rika right here in the center. We'll put Abe in the back because I have a feeling she's dating somebody. I have a feeling she's up to some sneaky business. And you go back here too. Ida's gonna be pretty happy. I'm gonna put her further up. Wait, why is Saika here? I'm gonna put her right there. Kay can go right here. Mari can go near the front. Godos can go right there. Tomi can go there, and Suji can go right there. I'm probably gonna kick out Sayaka soon and send her to Midnight Musume. I, w I wanna release this, but freaking Godo's not back yet. All right, concert time, let's do this. I think y'all are gonna like this. The camera failed, so we're gonna take it down. We lose 10% height, it's fine. 
Stamina costs 30. She doesn't have it. What are we gonna do? She should have taken a break before the concert. She had days off. Final song, Love Machine. 41% chance that something bad could happen. We made 4 million yen. So listen, they can crawl off. I'll give them a nice spa day tomorrow. A viral video has been circulating. Apparently, Yaguchi Marty lost her temper when a malfunctioning vending machine ate her money and didn't give her a drink. And she decided to take out her rage and frustration on the machine by kicking it. Who among us hasn't? Yaguchi Marty won't be facing any property damage fine since the only thing she damaged it by kicking the vending machine was her own foot. If the howls of pain heard in the video are anything to go by, worst of all, someone was there to record the entire incident and share it online. Some responses to the video laughingly mock Yagashimari for her self-inflicted pain, while others are berating her for losing her temper in public. This is starting to get out of hand. Have her apologize? Have her post a self-depreciating joke about the incident online. We did this last time. I feel like we should make fun of ourselves. Most of the people berating Yagashimari for her unbecoming public conduct are upset by the fact that she is making light of the situation. However, the public response to the video seems to shift as more and more people start posting about how they find her frustratingly relatable. After all, who hasn't been frustrated by a piece of technology malfunctioning? Yagashimari joking seems to make it easier for people to start laughing with her rather than laughing at her. Some people even start praising Mari as a ludite goddess who will help free us from the bondage of modern machines through violent revolution. Of course, they're just joking, right? She gained 80 fans. <laughs> Your sound technician, Shibaki Shigemasa, has come to you recently to complain about a bizarre undertone in the base of your recent recordings that he's compared to a human heartbeat, but like, dying. <laughs> Hakuna Asuka, who was the last one practicing in the room, has heard it on the tracks, and is absolutely convinced the room is haunted. She refuses to continue practicing in the studio until the matter is resolved. Some of the other girls are supporting her in a strike of sorts. You've listened to the recordings yourselves, but you're unable to hear anything off. Bizarre. Still, you probably won't hear the end of this until you make a decision. What will you do? Get an expert opinion from another audio professional. Call a spirit medium to investigate. The sound technician initially objects to the decision to bring in a spiritual solution to a technical problem, but Hukuda Asuka's concern eventually wins out. The medium is a charming man who, after an investigation of the studio, claims that the issues are indeed the work of a malevolent spirit requiring a ritual to dispel. This is Abe's bad energy. The medium spins around as though caught in a tornado, throwing salt everywhere, and tells you that the room is now purified against the spirit before leaving. It takes a while to clean up all the residual salt. Once things are cleaned up, the sound equipment does seem to be working again, with no more complaints from Fukuda Asuka. But I got some extra money, and I got relationship. Damn! Okay, 5,000 sales? That's not bad. 5,800, that's not bad at all. Oh, so we can do an another set of auditions for our, the fifth gen. I'm gonna swap around the order. Kono's gonna be at the top. She's gonna be part of my She's very cute. I know, and like her pose is adorable. Aha, aha, there she is. Jack of all trades. She learns 50% faster while training, whichever stat is currently their lowest. There she freaking is. There is my Aichen. So this will be my Makoto. She's cute, ah, oh, she's 19, 17. Weak vocal cord spends two times more stamina on performances. Why? Oh, damn. Okay, look. This girl freaking sucks. She has weak vocal cords and she spends two more, two times more stamina. But she comes in with perfect stats. All right, give me somebody good. Honestly, I feel like it's this girl right here. Plus, I love her style. We need to probably wrap up. I'll get Mr. Moonlight ready. I'm gonna save.